I'm Mike Huckman at the BioBus Center, where I am pleased to welcome the CEO of Forum Pharmaceuticals, Ms. Deborah Dunsire, who, as many people know, is the former CEO of Millennium Pharmaceuticals, the biotech giant. And in the interest of full disclosure, first of all, Ms. Dunsire, I should say that Forum Pharmaceuticals is a client of the company that I work for, but thanks for joining us. Thanks, Mike. It's great to see you. Great to be here. Yeah, it is. For those who are not familiar with Forum Pharma, who is it? What is it? What is your team working on there? Forum is working on serious brain diseases, dementia, schizophrenia. We're looking at cognition, the symptoms of brain disease, and then modifying dementias that are genetically targeted. And you're in late stage studies right now? Right now, with our pro-cognitive agent in Senaclean, we're in two global phase three programs, one in cognition and schizophrenia, one in Alzheimer's disease. I am guessing that after your very successful tenure at Millennium that you could have had your pick of any number of jobs in this sector. Why did you decide to go to a small, unknown, privately held company like Forum Pharmaceuticals of all places? You know, Mike, what's always motivated me about being in this industry is the ability to change outcomes for patients who don't have adequate therapy. In Alzheimer's disease and in schizophrenia, we don't have fully adequate therapies. In fact, for Alzheimer's, we, we lack many therapies at all. And so for me to invest my medical training in doing something like that is so important. But there's another aspect, and it's personal. Mm. My father-in-law is right now in a nursing home mm. with Alzheimer's. He was an OBGYN, a, a head of a department, leading a big hospital practice, and now, he doesn't know who I am, who his children are, or even the, the time of day, day of week. We have to change this. And sadly, so many of us, the forecast show, are going to face that kind of close relationship to there this terrible disease. There are five million Americans today with Alzheimer's disease, 16 million with the prodrome to Alzheimer's disease. And you and I both know the demographic in Western society is just evolving so that we'll face even more of that. We have to have adequate therapy. Ms. Dunsoy, according to Bio, there are 5,000 companies here that are taking nearly 30 thousand partnership meetings over the few days of this convention. It's kind of like speed dating for potential <laughs> partnerships. Oh, that, there's it, a picture. <laughs> is Forum in that flow? Is that one of the reasons you're here? You know, we are in the, in the phase of our life of talking to various different partners. We have some meetings here, we have some back at home in, in Boston, and Bio provides a great forum for touching base with companies who are really interested in this space and who want to know what's up with Forum, where are we at, how have we progressed since last year. Bio provides something really important to big and small companies alike in that ability to connect. And lastly, there's still a lot of buzz here about the IPO window. Is it open? Is it closed? Is it closing? What's your assessment of that? And is that something that could be in Forum's future as well, going well, public? When I, when I look back at the last two weeks, I'd say we'd have to say the window's still open. There have been some great offerings and, and really great reception for them. So when I think about Forum and its future and the possibilities that we have within Seneclean and some of our pipeline, I know that we're going to need access to capital. So it's definitely an avenue that's worth exploring for us, and, and we are. Yeah, and while not all in this sector, I think there's 16 IPOs on the docket uh, for this week alone as it's well. It's incredible what's been happening over 2013 and 2014 to date. I think 2014 has exceeded 2013 in the amount of money raised. Deborah Dunsire, the CEO of Forum, Forum Pharmaceuticals, first of all, best wishes to, to you and your family, of course, um, but also to you and the team at the company as you move forward. Really appreciate it, Mike. Thanks for the time. All right. Thanks for being here at the BioBus Center.